when adding sodium hydroxide to water, we have to be extremely careful and add small amounts at a time. This is an exothermic process, so it does release some heat. And by dissolving small amounts at one time, we're gonna get a much better, safer solution. And we're doing this outside because the fumes from the lye are very caustic. So we're doing this in an environment where most of those fumes can just um, move away from us as quickly as possible rather than in a closed setting. And you have to keep stirring it because it's wanting to clump on the bottom. The crystals are wanting to clump up together. And we know that we can increase the rate of dissolving a substance by constantly stirring. So that constant stirring motion does help. We have a thermometer inside our glass measuring cup there um, just so that we can keep up with the change in temperature and we'll try to take a look at that once everything is dissolved. Thank goodness we have a little bit of a breeze to serve as our exhaust fan. That's right. If we were in a brick and mortar lab, we would do this under the fume hood, and that fume hood would have the exhaust fan. So this would not be something that would be done just on any lab table or any kitchen counter.